the special representative of the chairperson of the African Union Commission for Somalia and head of AMISOM, Ambassador Maman Sidiku, outlined the mission's forecast for the year at a media briefing in Mogadishu. With the uh, incident of the 25th December 2014 when Al-Shabaab infiltrated AMISOM Halan camp. Uh, that unfortunate incident is a reminder to us, but to you all, to everybody, that we are fighting a terrorist organization that is desperate to remain relevant despite the heavy losses, the significant losses we have inflicted on, on it. He described 2014 as a momentous year in which the mission made significant strides, especially on the security sphere, an achievement that has been attested to by the booming economic activity, particularly in the capital Mogadishu and the vibrant political activity. For Amisam and all our partners, especially the good people and the government of Somalia, whom we are here to support, this incident has only strengthened our resolve to continue to fight Al-Shabaab so that the Somali people can enjoy peace and be free from terror. But Amisom looks to have a tough task ahead of them in achieving this. As minutes after the conference, a huge blast was reported in Mogadishu, with details still sketchy by press time. Amisom pledged continued support to the capacity building and enhancement of the Somali National Army and the Somali National Police Force, which is squat the Amisom exit strategy, including training and men.